Welcome everyone to our third podcast presented by Art So Wonderful and Poetry Pun here. I'm Candace Owens, the founder and CEO of Poetry Pun here. And we've got an exciting show for you today. And we have a guest that is joining us. And I will pass it over to Bruce before we introduce our guest to introduce himself and go over some upcoming events. All right. So I'm Bruce Wilson. I'm general partner of Art So Wonderful and executive director. And um before we talk to our wonderful guest, our winner, our, our um, poetry winner, I um, want to make a couple of announcements. And um, so um, Poetry Pioneer and Art So Wonderful, well, first of all, I want to thank everybody who came out for Juneteenth event, June 15th, 11 to 6, to help us with our community mural. The community mural is so beautiful and it's so nice, and over 60 people participated in that. And um, so I just want to thank the community, the mayor's office, Poetry Pioneer and all the rest of our um, sponsors for uh, helping us put this all together, help, helping us put that together. Now, on August 3rd, we're going to have up, our upcoming event with um, Poetry Pioneer and Art So Wonderful. We have another community mural, a gigantic, I think that thing is like 60 feet long there on Candace, that wall, You're really large. And what's going to happen on that is that um, people are going to send um, their mural designs to um, Candace and I that will prove that will go on the wall and then um, they will come out, sketch it on the wall and uh, we will, um, it's going to be, uh, they'll sketch on the wall and it's going to be like a paint by number. So indiv individuals who join us at that event, from August 3rd from 11 to 6 with a rain date of August the 10th, um, will be able to put stuff on that mural wall, like I think it's like 60 feet long and have a great day and have a good time. So, um, so back to you, Candice. <laughs> Our last poetry contest was really successful. And so it closed on May 31st. We had global participation and thank you to everyone who participated. Today we have our winner that is joining us. Um, he is from India and there is some communication that we have figured out, there's some communication barriers, but we figured out a way to get everyone here. So he's going to read his winning poem, which our theme was faith. So he's going to read his winning poem on that and just give a, a brief bio about himself and how he has always wanted to work with, you know, uh, someone in the United States or outside of his country and others. So I'll pass it on over to him to introduce himself. Uh, hello, uh, Himanshu, can you listen to me? Yes, we can hear you. Yeah, so uh, can, Ms. Candice, uh, if I, if you allow me, can I just uh, uh, translate to Himanshu what you were trying to say? Yes, that would be great. Please do. Yeah. Uh, did you repeat yeah. it or did you understand? No, no, I understood what you were trying to say. Was I would just like to translate him, translate it to him in 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 our native language, which is Hindi. Okay, thank you so much. Yeah, yeah, uh, Himanshu, uh, Candice. जी कह रही हैं कि आप अपने आप को इंट्रोड्यूस करें अपना इंट्रोडक्शन दें शायद आपका माइक म्यूट है तो आप उसे अनम्यूट कर दें प्लीज वो आपको सुन नहीं पा रहे वो वेट कर रहे हैं आपका आई एम हिमांशु आई एम परफॉर्मिंग ऑन नेशनल स्टेजेस फ्रॉम लास्ट 10 इयर्स एंड आई एम लिविंग इन उदयपुर राजस्थान इन इंडिया Thank you so much for, for joining us today um, and participating in our contest. It's been a great pleasure chatting with you back and forth. Um, and so if you don't mind, can you share your poem or would you like me to share it, whichever the one that you entered the contest with that you won? Uh, yeah, sure. Uh, Cand Ms. Candice, can you just uh, repeat what you said uh, so that I can translate it to him? Oh yeah, to keep, so he entered, I want his poem that he won the, the contest with, I wanted to know if he wants to recite that or if you would like to recite that or if you would like me to recite it, whatever is easier. So oh, okay, understood, understood. Just yeah. give me a minute. Okay. Hello. Hello. Yeah, yeah, hum sun pa rahe hain. Jo maine sona kya aapne wo sona. Jo maine kaha aapse. मिस मिस कैंड मिस कैंडिस जो है वो ये चाहती हैं कि जो कविता जिसे जिसे आपने भेजा था कंपटीशन में और जिसने आपको फर्स्ट प्राइस दिलाया था 
क्या आप उस कविता को यहाँ पढ़ना चाहेंगे या वो चाहे या आप ये चाहते हैं कि मैं पढ़ू या फिर मिसेस कैंडिस भी उन्हें पढ़ सकती है ओके होल्ड सो मिस कैंडिस हिमांशु वॉन्ट्स टू रिसाइक दैट पोएम सो कैन ही गो अहेड ओके हिमांशु वो पोएम रिसाइट करो प्लीज माय पोएम टाइटल इज स्माइल ऑन स्ट्रेंजर फेस सो जस्ट आई कैन स्टार्ट यस यस आई एम स्टार्टिंग द स्ट्रेंजर सो द मैन पासिंग बाय इन द स्ट्रीट आई सो अ स्माइल ऑन माय फेस एज आई सो माय हार्ट filled with joy the stars will the stars were shining in the sky as if her angels were twinkling in her feet uh, that person of the heart slowly came closer the smile on the stranger face is very sweet this closeness of his falls me every year it is fair that brings each other into our hearts This faith is the identity of that stranger. The smile on that stranger face is very sweet. Thank you. That's great. Thank you. Um, and I was so happy to read that poem because I know that we have worked together to try to help you get something in there that was kind of on the theme. Um, so thank you. Is okay. there anything else that you would like? I know that. Uh, Candice, yeah. Candice, could you read that? Could you read the poem for you know again? I mean, I I really like that poem, but could you read it as well? Could you, you read, want it? Me to read it? As yeah, well? yeah, you... yeah. Yes, go. Okay. So I'm gonna read it for Bruce as well. Okay. So he, um, so the title that he stated was "What Does Faith Mean to Me?" Um, and so it. It stated, the stranger saw the man passing by in the street, a small, I saw a smile on my face. I saw my heart filled with joy. The stars were shining in the sky as if her anklets were tingling in her feet. That person of the heart slowly came closer. The smile on the stranger's face is very sweet. Neither I have I met him nor have anything to do with him, but I have faith in his humanity. This closeness of his calls me every day. It is the faith that brings each other to our hearts. This faith is the identity of the stranger. The smile on the stranger's face is very sweet. So that was that was the poem he submitted. Very good. Very, very good. Round of applause. <laughs> nice. Thank you. Good job. And so um, I'm very happy that uh, we're able to um, get you on our uh, podcast. And um, uh, Candace have told me a lot about you, and and, um, and we talked, discussed your uh, poetry, which is um, incredible. And we know that you've won uh, poetry contests. Am I talking too fast, Ali? You because you gotta um, translate. Uh no, I am able to understand uh, what you are trying to say, I mean, but I, uh, I, I I would like like to ask him if he wants the translation. Then I can do it for him so that well, he can. Well, yes, yeah, sir, please continue. Well, Will he understand what I'm saying, Ali? If you don't translate, no, he's able to. But for just a uh, better clarification, I'm here, so I'll. Uh, okay. So if awesome. you have any, if you have okay. any questions, or if you yeah. have any uh, compliments to say, okay. I'll just sure. transfer it to him. Sure, sure. So let me finish. So anyway, so I'm so I'm thank you so much for um being a part of Poetry Pioneer as well as Art So Wonderful, um and and I know through Candace that you've won some um, competitions with poetry in your in your country in India. And um that's really good. Now you obviously you're you're a good poet and um from many like your poetry. And so we're very happy for you to be a part of our team and and also um making you one of our winners that um seemed to uh, helped you out a lot. You know, I you know it's a fifty dollar uh winner and I think that uh fifty US dollars and I think it helped you a lot in your country or helped you out yourself or your own personal needs. And uh, we want you to continue to be a part of what we do with Poetry Pioneer and Act So Wonderful and get all the rest of your peers involved and see how ways we can all um, share poetry from individuals from India. So um, thank you again, uh, Sharma. 
Okay, so sir, can I take this moment to translate to him what you have said? Yes, thank you. Uh, Himanshu, can you listen to me? Yes, yes. So, sir, you are saying that you have listened to your poetry suni, Miss Kangis ke through. उनको आपकी कविता बहुत ही पसंद आई वो आपको मुबारकबाद देना चाहते हैं कि आपने ये कांटेस्ट जीता आपको जो 50 डॉलर का पुरस्कार मिला है उन्हें उम्मीद है कि वो पैसे आपको आगे जाकर बहुत काम आएंगे उन्होंने आपकी प्रक... उन्होंने आपको कॉम्प्लीमेंट किया है उन्होंने ये भी जाना है इस कंपटीशन के जरिए कि आप एक बहुत प्रसिद्ध कवि हैं भारत में राजस्थान को रिप्रेजेंट करते हैं और आपने बहुत ही अच्छा लिखा है उनकी आशा यही है कि आप मिस कैंडिस और इस तरह के कॉम्पिटिशंस के साथ हमेशा जुड़े रहें और और भी कवियों को मोटिवेट करते रहें और अपना क्राफ्ट और अच्छे लेवल पर भेजते रहें। So sir, what I translated to him is that you as a person were very very happy and you were very satisfied with what with what he wrote in his poetry. You complimented him really well. You told him that the prize that you have won definitely would have helped you in uh, bettering your finances and would have motivated you more to write more poems in English and, and to keep tie up and keep competing uh, in partnerships with competitions that you organize. I hope I was successful in translating successfully with what you said. Go ahead, Candice. Yes, you were. Thank you so much for translating. Go ahead, Candice. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Um, so is there anything else he would like to share while he's on the show with any of the listeners that he's here today? If you want to give him a minute and ask him that question, and then you just let me know. Uh sure, Miss Candice. Uh Himanshu, uh Miss Candice, I've said pooch rahi hai ki kya aap और कोई ऐसी चीज है और कोई बात है जो आप अपने इस करियर की शेयर करना चाहती हैं जिसे वो बता सकती हैं या फिर या फिर इस पॉडकास्ट को यही एंड करना चाहेंगे ये मैं बताना चाहता हूं कि मैंने लिखना कब से शुरू किया और कैसे किया ओके सो मिस कैंडिस हिमांशु वुड लाइक टू शेयर हिज एक्सपीरियंस ऑफ हाउ he started his writing journey. So if you're interested, can he move on? Yes, please share his experience. Yes. Okay. Himanshu, aap apna experience hum se share ki jye. Mein koshish karunga ki unko best translate kar sako. Okay, okay. Uh, my father has always been fond of poetry. And so I once went to a program with him. And uh, I saw there that a boy of my age was a... Uh, Visiting poetry since then I started writing poetry. Hey, so a family of poets. Okay. That did I understand that right? Uh yes, yes. Probably. So he said in in a better way, if I explain what he said is that the he started writing from the moment when there was a time when his father took him to a poetry competition where a boy of his age was reciting poetries and that inspired him to try and uh, start writing on uh, and working on poetries related to emotions that uh, we ca we counterpart in our daily lives as indians great job that's a group i mean in poetry heals right so what better way to to express those emotions than writing poetry so thank him for yeah. sharing and i love his writings by the way they're very great yeah Okay, so Himanshu, uh, Candice Ji, who are you, are complimenting you that you are very good and she is a fan of poetry. She has become a fan of your words and poetry. Uh, so, Miss Candice, hello, Miss Candice. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so he wants to uh, share that why do he write poems? What is that? What is the aim and objective of writing poems? So can he go ahead? Go right ahead. Yeah, go ahead. Hello, Himanshu. Kindly hold on, ma'am. I think there's some network uh, network issue that might be going on with the interpreter. 
या सो मैम ने कहा है कि आप आग, आप प्रोसीड कीजिए और बताइए कि आपने आप क्यों लिखते हैं इसकी वजह क्या है Uh, okay, so uh, Miss Candice and Sir Himanshu said that the reason why he started writing is that Himanshu believes that with poetry and writing, a negative mindset of people all over the world can can have a great impact in being changed to a positive response. Through writing, we can express uh, what's going on inside our heads, and we can try to. Uh, tackle the negativity that we all somewhere face in our lives so his aim and objective of writing poetry is to to make sure that with his poetry and his words he can take out all the negativity and toxicity in the, the people's minds and can and he can plant a flower or a plant of positivity inside mm -hmm. nice nice and that's beautiful well yeah. I want to thank you so much for sharing all of that with us. And I, my same, my goal is the same mission with my poetry. And part of the reason that I founded Poetry Pioneer and Bruce does videos with Art So Wonderful is because we want to help people not only make their dreams come true, but to spread the positivity across the world. And this is a great collaboration, I feel like, and a first step to doing that, despite, you know, language barriers or distance we were still able to recognize the beauty and the power of word um so again thank you and we have another contest coming up and i think i have kind of mentioned it to him but i'm encouraging him and others to participate and so if does he have anything else he would like to share with us today or um if not then i want to thank you again for your time um sure so uh, Himanshu, uh, so Miss Candice has said that she also thinks the same way, the way you think, like words, poetry and writing have the power to change the world. In Hindi, if I say, Miss Candice bhi wahi vishwas rakhti hai jo aap rakhte hai ki kavitao mein aur shabdo mein dunia ko badalne ki taakat hai. Wo bhi isi maksad se is project mein judi hui hai. और वो यही कह रही हैं कि आने वाले समय में भी एक कंपटीशन है जिसकी जानकारी वो आपको ऑलरेडी दे चुकी हैं उम्मीद है आप और आपके जैसे कई लोग उसमें हिस्सा लेंगे और उनका आखिरी सवाल ये है द लास्ट क्वेश्चन ही ट्राइंग टू पुट इज दैट कि क्या आप इसमें और कुछ मेंशन करना चाहेंगे और अगर नहीं तो वो बहुत शुक्रगुजार है आपके यहाँ आने के लिए इफ इफ यू डू नॉट हैव एनी थिंग एल्स टू एक्सप्रेस शी एंड सर दे बोथ आर वेरी थैंकफुल टू यू for giving your time to this podcast and expressing your views on writing nice no no so i want to say that to mendo uh, i will also participate in your future contest okay so mai ye bol do unko ki this ye end hai aur wo aap unko thank you keh rahe hain okay so uh, sir and candice himanshu uh, has said that uh for now there's nothing uh, anything there's no nothing else she, he would like to share right. but he is th very thankful to both of you for giving him the opportunity to write and express even though there was a very very uh, difficult way to go through in a competition which had a large language barrier but he still mm -hmm. managed to win yeah. it yeah. he's proud of it and candice he has a special message for you that he will participate and he will try to best to win again nice. and that's should nice. be the end of the podcast. Yeah, then. right. And I just want to say one last thing before uh, we go into our next segment, and that is oh, sure. that um, um, Ali and Shama, I want to um, thank you for um, inspiring people in the United States of America with your words and your wisdom. And we all going to like Candice was saying, we all learn from each other. And so we want to um, have your uh, guests on our uh, podcast show, and maybe even our cable show soon. So uh, Candice will talk to you about it that too. So thank you again, and and I appreciate your time and being a winner. Yeah, Himanshu, you would like to say something? You were saying something. आप कुछ कह रहे थे? 
Atta, please, can you ask him? Uh, can they share with the recorded link? ओके ओके इससे पहले मैं ये बात उन तक रखूं सर आपसे ये कह रहे हैं कि आप ही अब वो आपको शुक्रिया अदा करना चाहते हैं कि आपने उनको और अमेरिका में जो लोग बैठे हैं उनको अपने शब्दों से और विजगम से बहुत इंस्पायर किया है वो आपको आने वाले भविष्य के एक और पॉडकास्ट में यहाँ तक कि अपने केबल शो में भी देखते हैं कि उम्मीद करते हैं ये उन्होंने आपसे कहा है ओके so can this answer i have forwarded him the message that you both are very thankful to him that uh, his words have not just inspired you but the but the, but the whole united states of america regarding wisdom and expressions that we all would like to carry with a complete full heart and the question himanshu has put it in, in front of you is that he has requested that uh, can you just sh share the link of uh, this recording Oh, he's muted now. Pardon me, ma'am. Yes, we will share. We'll share the recording once it's available. It will be on the CCTV website and YouTube, and we can share that with you guys. So, okay. And the last message again, and then we're going to keep going. But you all are more than welcome to go off the call because I know it's late there. So, thank you again for taking the time to be on the show, and I will be posting more info about the upcoming contest. Contest and stay in touch. Okay. Okay, Miss Candice. Right. See okay. you later. Thank, Thank you. you. He's gonna so, trans. He's gonna translate it. Okay. Oh, okay. Oh, sure, sure. Yeah. Uh, hey, Manchu. Uh, so Candice, ma'am, कह रही हैं कि वो आपको इसकी लिंक डेफिनेटली प्रोवाइड करेंगी जैसे ही उनकी वेबसाइट cctv.com पे और YouTube पे इसकी लिंक आ जाएंगी वो आपसे संपर्क करेंगी और आने वाले कंपटीशन के लिए ऑलरेडी वो आपसे संपर्क कर चुकी हैं तो थोड़ा सा वेट कीजिए और वो आपको इस पॉडकास्ट पे आने के लिए थैंक यू कह रही हैं इसके साथ ही पॉडकास्ट का अंत होता है मैं चाहूँगा कि आप दोनों जो हमारे मेहमान हैं उन्हें शुक्रिया अदा कहें उन्हें ये मौका देने के लिए thank you yeah yeah i want i want to say to thank you all and especially thank you miss kendis for every time you support thank you all right can just let's move on to the um the next segment thank you okay all right guys so we'll see talk to you soon have have a good rest here or get some rest right yeah <laughs> Get some sleep. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> definitely, definitely. Thank you. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you. See you later. Bye. Bye. Yeah, so that was a good show. I appreciate the guest. You know, I mean, and, and translator, interpreter. Um, I guess what is it? Translator, inter either way. Yeah, either way. Translator. Person, guess, but we got through it. So yeah, yeah. Of course, of course, of course. I mean, um, you know, had a little technical at first, but we um. Uh, we plowed right through it, and um, I was happy that um, we were able to do so. I knew we would, you know what I mean, because, you know, everything works in divine order and too great to measure. So what, 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 how else could it be? I mean, the more than what it is. So what's up now? Um, Candace R. Owens, number one, the light. Well, I mean, I think that went really well. We had our first guest, which was really exciting. And it was a little bit, I think, challenging because there was that international and language barrier, but we made it happen. So we'll go ahead and announce the next contest July 1st. Yeah. Like I said, the open 30 days theme is love. Um, and right now, I mean, I think the world needs love more than ever. Uh, yeah. So we just got to stay on the narrow path and keep just spreading that light by trying to do it with the power of words, even if it's speaking words. Doesn't have to be poetry. Just be kind in everything you say and do. Right. I think right. would be helpful. Yeah, yeah. And so, uh, CCTV is going to put that um, poster on uh on this show once we um, you know, once they edit it and uh, do their do they what they do to our shows, they'll add that posters and hopefully I'll have the other one in time so they can put that in it too. The August thirty, you know, but you know. Um, I like the I like the, that post you you made up real fast. I know you're like God three minutes to before the show. You were asking me, <laughs> well, hey, you good like that? I mean, so um, before we cut off here, um, so what's our next show? Is is the theme is love? You say what's the theme? Yeah, the next poetry theme is love. 
So there will be no entry fee, though there's no prize though. The winner, well, the prize, there is a prize. The prize is you get to be on the podcast. That is the prize. You're gonna get your time to shine, share your um, words with the world. And, you know, as you can see, we have global impact. So we're, we would like to have more local impact too, just because we wanna affect our immediate community, whether it's in Vermont or Kentucky or just anywhere that, you know, but we'll take what we can get. So we're happy with, you know, no matter what distance that people are participating. No um, doubt about it. But yes. and I think the reason that we did the dreams come true is because in speaking with our guests, his dream was one of his biggest dreams was to collaborate with someone in the United States. So that was really exciting to do that with our platform. Yeah. Uh, and also, um, I think his name is Sharma, his last name, was mm -hmm. saying was saying that um um is um I mean, and you um he won a lot of contests. You want to talk about that a little bit? Some of the contests you won a lot of national yeah. contests in India, is it? Or just around other places? Yeah, so apparently he has won like national contests in India. So he has been nice. like he works full time, but poetry is like his passion. So mm -hmm. he's a lot of time participating in contests and doing things over there. And so you could see the passion just in his willingness to do what was ever, you know, to not even speak the same language, but try to do what you can to translate and make it happen. I think just shows when people, as we say, stay on the narrow path and they do what's needed because they're like, you know what? I want this. I want to win. I want to make my dreams come true. I want to, um, you know, as he has the same mission as I kind of do in a little bit to change the world with the power of any power that you have, whether it's words or just like, you know, the murals, the beautiful art across Vermont that you're doing and other places like we're, we're making an impact. Um, yeah, no doubt. And so um, before we go, let's just take a couple minutes and I want to talk a little bit about the August 3rd event and that uh, we, we both are putting on um, Poetry Pioneer and Art So Wonderful are putting on, we, we got this incredible, it's called Art So Wonderful Alley, Art Alley. And it's going to be uh, right downtown Vermont, Burlington, Vermont. And um, I think this the first part of it is going to be like, it's like 60 feet long. And so what's happening is that um, people will, will, you know, we're going to about to send it out to everywhere. So all our networks were as a um, call to muralists, call to artists to come and lay down um, that we choose, that you and I choose and, um, the um, theme of their mural. And they'll come sketch it on the wall, that wall that once we approve it. And people from anywhere, I mean, if they come from India, anywhere, they can come and um paint by kind of like paint by a number thing. And mm -hmm. uh, it's gonna be so it's called community thing, community thing. I mean community um interactive. So it's I, I can't wait for that one. That's gonna be a good one. <laughs> That's gonna be a good one, Candace. So uh, Wow, we really are going to talk about um somewhere somehow you can come you know collab for that one for real, but um because the last one we did for Juneteenth event was over sixty people was on that wall and so this one is so much bigger, like three times bigger yeah about three maybe three and a half four times bigger larger space where I know it's going to be tons of people going to be coming up for this wall, and um our um. CCTV, Art So Wonderful, and Poetry Pioneer cable show is going to be out there. And uh, we're going to be talking to people, asking with the, you know, the regular questions, you know, what you, you know, your, you know, how you feel about your theme or your, or how do you feel about putting on work on a public place? And, um, and so I'm just so happy. So it's August 3rd from 11 to 6 with the rain date of August 10th, same time, 11 to 6. Hopefully it's not raining in August, but... <laughs> <laughs> never okay. know, baby. Yeah, never mean, know. Well, and I have super exciting news that I wanted to announce that I think that you know about, but the listeners don't know about now. So I've been talking since episode one about publishing a book, and it has yes. happened. So it is live now on Amazon, and all of our podcast winners, future that will be on the contest, will win a, a book as a gift. Um, but it is called New World Light, and it is poetic affirmations to create your own heaven on earth. So okay. hopefully, if you don't know, you will know now after listening that mindset is what makes your reality. So if you wake right. up in the morning, if you transform that, you can transform your world. So that's kind right. of my goal with the book. And so right. and right. we're beautifying the environment, and we beautify the mind. And right. that's how we start making it happen. Right. 
And plus it's like it's like 60 affirmations, right? Yeah, 60 and, uh, affirmations. We'll go over the go over the table table of contents. Go over it. The table of contents. All right. Yeah, all right. Yeah, I actually included two poems too. So um yeah, hold it up. Was, Let's see it. Hold the book up. Let's see it. You got it. Hold on. Let me hold it up. Oh my my background. I can't there it is. Oh, I can't see it. I, oh, I can't get it. I got a background on. Yeah. Um, but it's a pretty short thing. I've got the dedication, table of contents, a little bio, a prelude, um, the poem Be Kind. That poem has been a big hit with anything that I've done. It seems to really, I think I've got over 8,000 likes on the post on Instagram. So it's one of my bigger hits there. Um, I got a midpoint check-in. We got 30 day affirmations. Then we do a midpoint check-in. Another poem today is the day 31 the next 30 days of affirmations, conclusion, and then the end. So, and this book's made a little different. It's not made to read all at once. You're going to read it every day and kind of follow it along. And the goal is people kind of write their affirmations as they go. So they're kind of taking the journey with me through the 60 days. And they right. can kind of see, and not all of my thoughts are positive. Like I wake up saying how I feel. So like one of them, I'm like, I woke up late, you know, I woke up, my toe hurts. Like just realistic things. So it's right. just taking yeah. my everyday right. feelings and trying to make the best of it all right so uh candace owens number one light take us out with be kind take us out with the read be kind oh you want me to read the be kind poem? that's right mm -hmm. go right ahead i love that poem. i open the book up with so i'll close this with Woo! it <laughs> well kind. yeah right be kind please let's get out of our mind Please let's leave the evil and drama behind. We can all seek what we wish to find. We have to take a break and get out of the daily grind. We have to look at what we're truly assigned. We cannot leave, let the world keep heading towards decline. We have to wake up as we have been designed. Even though some can see we are all a form of blind, what happened to mankind? Things have become gods and humans have become mine. We are all one, we are humankind. Let's realign. Let's, uncaught, let's unlock our subconscious mind. Mm -hmm. We can change the world by breaking free and not being confined. We can reset and we can redefine. All we have to do is take a deep breath and be kind. No doubt about it. Thank you so much, Candice. I appreciate all the poetry. It makes me feel good that I hit, get to hear all the affirmations every day that you um are, that you have done and the yes. ones that you're about to go into your, uh, to the next, next um book. Um, so, um, you know, it's always a pleasure to talk with you and always you pleasure too. to see you. And, um, and I'm always, you know, make me feel good. I feel happy. I'm glad about our show. We, we're really getting bigger and better and people around the world are, are identifying with us. And, um, how wonderful is that, man? That's a big deal. So, um, um, can you just say one more time, uh, how they can reach, re um, how they can get the book? People yeah, so you can get it on Amazon.com. You can look it up that way. Or the easiest way is probably to go to my website. I have plenty of links there, www.poetrypioneer.com. Um, and it is available on global platforms. So it doesn't matter where you're at. You should be able to purchase it. But that's probably the best way to get it. And um, if you search on Amazon, you can find it. But I, I've advertised as much as I can. But hopefully, if you have any questions, just get in contact with us and we'll help you get a copy of it. And the name of it again is? The name of it again is The New World Life, Poetic Affirmations to Create Heaven on Earth. And I did do Candace R. Owens so that I wasn't confused with the other Candace Owens, who is a politician. So I was mindful of that um, nice. so that there's no confusion there. But yeah, yeah, thank you for that hint there too, Bruce. Didn't <laughs> um, <laughs> there to be two different people, totally different people. Well, um, yeah, one is white, one is black, so it's kind of hard to confuse. It's not hard to confuse much, but unless you're just looking at the name. But um, yeah. yeah, I'm glad you put that R in there. So, all right. So I'll all talk right. with you. Well, well, we'll be talking probably sometime to, later on today about our shows or things, yeah. things that we need to do or um, go over the, our measurements for uh, this show and um, what we're going to do next. Um, finalize our date for our next one. I think you said that. What days you say? I got to. We're going to shoot towards, I think, towards the end of July. Is what oh. our goal is going to be. Yeah. 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 All righty. So you'll put it All out right. there to everybody and have a good day, Candace. Oh, it's the light. Everybody else have a good one too. Have a Bye. good one, everybody. Bye.